if you plan to buy your own FPGA starter kit, I would recommend to get the most recent upgraded Nexus, which Digiland call it Nexus 2. And the address of Digiland is www.digilandinc.com. Browse the product. The first thing you will see is the upgraded Nexus 2. Uh, by looking at the specification, notice specifically it now uses Spartan 3 with 500k gate as opposed to 200 kilo gate in Nexus 2, similar to the older Spartan 3 that I have. On top of that, it uses the USB 2 port. It has restored the four six pin header. Uh, well, they kept the six, four six pin header that appear in Nexus. The VGA and PS2 and the serial port that has been eliminated in Nexus has not been restored and, no, and moreover it come with a JTAG programming cable. Here is the big improvement. It will now include 500 gate, K gate siling Spartan 3. And the SD RAM is 16 megabyte the flash is also 16 megabyte. That is quite an impressive for the same price of $99. Here is the much more detailed specification of this. And this is the appearance of the serial and PS, P, uh, BGA and the PS2. And the number of LED and slide switch and push button remain the same, as well as four seven segment LED. Here is basically the same as in the Nexus, except it has more peripheral and much larger amount of flash and memory. The one to be soon to become obsolete is Nexus. Notice it only uses 100 pin heroes plug connector, although it provided a JTAG programming cable, but the amount of the FPJ is only 200K gate. And the flash is the same, 16 megabyte. And the SRAM, I believe, is also the same amount. Let's look at the more detail of that description, which is shown right here. 16 SD RAM, 16 kilobyte, megabyte SD RAM, and 16 kilobyte flash memory. but it has no PS2, no VGA port serial, which is, that's why this become obsolete quite fast. Now the older one, the one I have is completely obsolete uh, now. Here it is. It has uh, only one megabyte SRAM and the amount of flash is also very limited. Let's look at the more detailed description. This is the one I have, which I got long time ago for the same amount of 
price $99. This is the overall. It has only one megabyte SRAM as opposed to 16 megabyte that you have. So if I were you, I will order the more recent upgraded version. Next is to for the amount of peripheral and memory for the same price of $99. You can use this for the course EE354 as well as EE404 in case you like to take that second course.